Well, the Army is fighting to get stronger. Officials came together this morning at Fort Eustis to test out a new program they hope will improve physical fitness among soldiers. Ten of your side's Kara Dixon gives us a first-hand look on a plan they believe will make soldiers more fit for war. The current fitness test has been in place for nearly 40 years, and starting this fall, thousands of soldiers will be testing out the new one to work out any kinks. And if these runs of the new test here at Fort Eustis are any indication, oh boy, good gracious! <laughs> well, soldiers will be getting a heck of a workout. The day I took it, I knew this is exactly what our army needs. That's pretty good. It's been six years in the making. Coming up with this new test to replace the current one. Just an old soldier's tale that in our army, everyone does their push-ups, sit-ups, and run every day. And uh, that actually doesn't prepare the entire body. The newer test will with six events instead of three. There's a strength deadlift, the hand release push up, go, sprint, drag, carry, one last sprint, standing power throw, oh, there you go. the leg tug. And yes, the two mile run still there. Well, it is it is harder. But General Stephen Townsend, who was a cadet when the current test came out 38 years ago, says this training is what they need to improve. So if this is all you do for PT, the Army's okay with that because you'll be better preparing for the tests on the battlefield. There are some differences, not a lot of rest time. 50 minutes, you will work for about 37 minutes or so, and you will rest for only about 11 or 12 minutes in this test. But Townsend says research shows these exercises will reduce injuries, a problem that plagues many soldiers. I do like it. And Major Adam Nestor, who was one of the many Army leaders out testing it today, believes soldiers will too once they get a chance to try it themselves. This is a proven test. Uh, it's going to make our Army stronger. Um, but again, change is never easy. So it's going to take some time. Uh, but everyone out here, as you can see, is working hard and very excited about uh, the way ahead with, with this new fitness test. Field testing will last for a year, and by 2020, it will be the official fitness test of the Army. Reporting at Fort Eustis, Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.